All right, so here today, I haven't gone over this stuff yet. I went and compiled the last two anniversaries. Remember, this is not the first anniversary, so don't expect 120 summons. You're coping if you think that's the case. Also, in my last comment section, or two videos ago, I don't know, uh, whenever I uploaded that Modernia video, um, a lot of players were thinking it's Alt Modernia. Now, I'll make it clear, we do not know. But leakers are saying it's not Alt Modernia, it's a skin. So if you're coping for Alt Modernia, wake up, it's one of the roses. It's most likely not, but you could be right. A point, like, 1% chance. Everything is possible at the end of the day, but leakers are saying it's most likely a skin because of the tagging in the files or something like that. Um, so not an alt art or, or alt character, okay? Keep that in mind. And they would never show the alt that early, in my opinion. <laughs> they wouldn't. But we could be wrong. Who knows? But that being said, move on from that. Next topic. Today, we're talking about a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff that people have been asking me, and a lot of stuff that I want to show you regarding this anniversary and what to expect and what to be uh, kind of hyped for. As always, keep your expectations low because they could definitely make an abysmal update that is always possible and reason to prove that to you. Make that clear. Let's hop into it. Like and subscribe. Help us out a ton. Let's hop over there. So I went and basically went and tried to find these two uh, tweets over here. This was the first tweet where it showed us basically what our first anniversary was. Our first anniversary is definitely not what this anniversary is because they're not one-upping the first anniversary. They're one-upping the half anniversary, correct? In my my opinion right i don't think they're going to give 120 free summons um like they did last time i think the final total is like either 126 or 136 dude they were kicking summons just left and right but i don't think it's gonna be like that i think it's gonna be more so like this where it's um 55 free summons where in the end it became like 65 uh due to the extra multi that came afterwards uh remember the game always goes top grossing the only thing is i don't know if it's gonna go top grossing now Correct. After ReZero, it proven to you. Uh, 2B, A2. Uh, 2B did not go top grossing. A2 went to top grossing. They were able to make, um, you know, a nice little uh, tweet and announce to us that, oh, because of you, we went top grossing. Here's some gifts. And we got free multi. Uh, with uh, Red Hood, they did go top grossing. With Scarlet, they did go top grossing. Mm -hmm. And with Modernia, I think they went top grossing. Um, the other two that confirmed Modernia, I think so. Uh, so for this one, if they go top grossing, it's an extra gift. But again, we don't know. Correct? So make that clear. Uh, exactly. The collaboration did not go top grossing, which is baffling. Correct? That, that should have uh, given the collaboration it was, or collaboration stats. But you clearly saw I didn't. So keep that in mind. Beyond that, I went looking and I quickly compiled a few things. First things first, I found the tweet for this first anniversary rewards. I'll go over this first and then I'll uh, move my way through the other one. Remember, it's most likely not this, but if you want to cope, you can cope. Basically, again, during the first anniversary, you can obtain up to 127 recruitment vouchers. In the end, it became like 137. There was an extra multi afterwards, after all of this. SSR Snow White Innocent Days was given back then. This time, remember, it could be, could be chime because last time was a pilgrim first time was ray ray was cool but you know snow white created a whole different amount of hype so chime could be here to create that same amount of hype because chime is playable we know that from like a while ago and um or can be playable and um it wouldn't be right to make her uh, like a pilgrim character at all most players don't care <laughs> as much as chime is cool and whatnot most players will not will for her so uh, remember that first anniversary event they gave us this they gave us this and they gave us this uh, this thing basically just gave us a um what is it? A uh, like free synchro device slot, and that's it. <laughs> that's all that was. Uh, this over here was a free multi, and this over here was standard stuff. Um, that wasn't a selector, right? That wasn't an SSR selector. No, right? No, I don't. There was an SSR selector afterwards, right? With the uh, other stuff. First anniversary gift: ten summons over here, so twenty summons so far. Thirty summons over here. Uh, these things were from the live stream milestone reached. We're gonna probably have a same event this year. Uh, first anniversary gift, just for giving it to us for a gift. Uh, they had gift codes back then. First Annie show, which also popped up. You'll definitely get some gift codes this time. First anniversary with you. You'll definitely get some gift codes this time. And then official community rewards, which again you'll get a, a bunch of these multis here, so don't you worry. And then again, three hundred gems over here. Free daily recruit. This one hundred percent will most likely come back because it came for the for a uh, 0.5 anniversary and it's a big event it's just it gives players a chance to actually get some stuff here so it is very nice right so for what it is i didn't pull anything last uh last festival or anniversary i did pull a lot in dorothy's one i pulled a free a two free door one two free dorothy's i think so not bad red ash story event does give you a bunch of stuff uh 25 advanced group vouchers uh two of the innocent um snow white days thing yeah and then a bunch of other stuff on the side so 25 more summons from that and then the playlist login event gave you 15 more vouchers so a lot and a lot was given away um, basically in just the event alone 
It's already four multis, uh, which is a lot. So that's how they handled the anniversary. I mean, the first one with this one. This is the half anniversary. Let's see what they cooked up on this one. Let's open up both tweets for you so you can take a look. Uh, first things first, God's Victory, half anniversary. Half anniversary update is coming soon. And we prepared in-game events and rewards. Uh, and here's what they gave away. We received a total of 57 free recruitments, which in the end got an extra 10. Um, as always, opportunities, new SSR Nick A Ray. So they gave you a max Ray, basically. Which again, I'm thinking chimes would be the same way. I'm hoping. And various development materials. Right, there is a free character, confirmed, 100%. Um, otherwise, it's an L of an update because they've always given a free character. So we have to at least maintain status quo. So I'm hoping that that is the free character. Um, next up, they did this over here half anniversary events and benefits. Um, basically, benefit one login to receive an advanced recruit voucher. Um, and SSR Nikkei, it's 10 advanced recruit vouchers just for logging in and one free SSR rate just for getting into the game. That's it. Uh, next up, benefit two half anniversary development gift pack. This is a um, after this, it's just in the mail. In mail. That's it. So three hours, three hours, three hours um, of just a battle data set and courthouse and credits. So standard stuff there. Half anniversary appreciation package. Um, what is it? After in game mail sent, collect the uh, anniversary appreciation, pa appreciation package via game mail. Five more vouchers. So there you go. Commander uh, code, correct? Ordinary recruit voucher times one. So definitely the first anniversary to 10. Big difference. <laughs> Big freaking difference. Uh, over here, 11 free recruitments for the half anniversary. I think they're going to do 14 this time or 21. Depends. Because this was just 11 for some reason. While the event was much longer, everyone was like, why? Why did you make it so short, though? So they're definitely going to up this one, in my opinion. But it is a, a free recruit a day. Uh, I think it's up to 21 uh, or 14. They could, they could do uh, somewhere between that. Um, Overzone PvE event kicked up, right? Uh, which is also there. You got from this event alone, 10-10, and then the two copies there. So again, much different than what it was with uh, the first anniversary, and then 10 over here. So don't expect the first anniversary uh, kindness. I think it's more so half anniversary. So expect around 60-ish uh, summons. That's it. Don't expect any more. Don't expect any more. Um, it's, it's kind of always the case when it's... Uh, a half anniversary is not as hyped as the first anniversary because again, if they make this super hyped, then the second anniversary, and then you know they have to keep this whole notion going. But I would say uh, maybe they're a little bit more generous than the half any. This time they do like instead of um, let's say sixty summons, maybe they do seventy to eighty summons. But I don't think it's the generosity of one hundred and thirty summons, dude. I think that was more so again saved um, for that first anniversary, and then the second anniversary, and then the third, fourth, fifth, and so on, and so forth. Right. So that's my take on it all. So what would I say to expect? around 60 to 70 summons, and um, I expect to get a free character because it's always happened, it's precedent, right? Beyond that, in our last, last event, remember, not Dorothy, because Dorothy, or sorry, not, um, yeah, not Dorothy and not Red Hood, because there was no other event like those uh, previous to those events. In our uh, New Year's event, where there was a previous event, they did, in fact, host their first ever rerun for a pilgrim. That was Modernia. A lot of my comments are saying that, oh, wait a second, Gogo, is there a chance Dorothy reruns? I'm gonna be honest with you, there's a high chance, right? It's not as requested as Modernia. Modernia is like the number one requested rerun, uh, and that was like requested for so long. In this case, Dorothy's not like highly requested, but players do want her. Um, so I could definitely see a rerun occurring for this character. I'll be very honest with you, right? The game definitely, or they obviously shift up, right? Saw the success of what the New Year's update was. It was a 30 million month, correct? Just because of Scarlet and Modernia. <laughs> <laughs> that update sold, absolutely sold. So, in my opinion, to make sure that if you hate Crown and players want to go and dupe out their, their Dorothy, it's a win-win for them. I also experience, or expect, not experience, expect to experience a Red Hood rerun during the uh, second anniversary and so on and so forth. As time progresses, I see that happening, but uh, we don't know confirmed. We don't have any, uh, you know, official, official answer here, but I do expect to see a Pilgrim rerun, and that being Dorothy for this, it makes the most sense. It would operate in the best manner, and it would be a very cool little thing here for players who, again, who, again want to, you know, get Dorothy, right? It, it's big numbers for them at the end of the day and um it's them winning in both ways they win in the way of making money and they win in the way of supporting the community and helping them get a character they may have missed because again it is a pilgrim who deserves the rerun as players may have picked up the game at the one point uh two part and not pull dorothy or the point seven part and not pull dorothy correct so 
Remember that that's where it currently stands, and I do think that there's a very high chance Dorothy gets a rerun, but there's no confirmation, so I don't want to say too much there. What I can say for certain, almost though, is you should get at least 60 plus summons. That has to happen because anything less than that is already bad sentiment with the community because they want to see you one up every any. Uh, like again, not expecting to one up the first any, I'm expecting to one up the half any. So around 60 to 70, um, and then again when it comes to uh, Ray. I'm expecting to see some sort of change there because again ray into snow white into chime would be a very cool thing correct um and it might set the notion in motion write it down rhymes uh that maybe pilgrims are like you know basically some sort of pilgrims right uh release as the free units constantly which are cool right it's very cool so uh, let me know what you think again i'm not expecting first any material first any was just whew, it was just beautiful all right it was just beautiful and um, I'm expecting to see it. My comments absolutely cook and make the greatest jokes about uh, like this anniversary compared to um, a certain other uh, game. If you know, if you've watched my channel during the other anniversaries, you know which game I'm referring to. So I'm expecting to see some very hilarious comments there. And um, best comment, uh, get something. <laughs> I gotta find a good comment and do that. But it's just funny. It's it's a it's a it's a gag we have going in this community here. So with that being said, take care, have fun, peace out. And I'm expecting to see some good comments regarding that uh, if we went up them. So remember that. You know who it is. With that being said, take care, have fun.